Yeah, there were some good, I guess, and very bad commercials in the Super Bowl. Uh, let's start with some of the bad commercials. Um, probably don't remember many of them because they were this bad. Remember the uh, Make Your Moves Count TurboTax commercial with Quinta Brunson? They consider that one of the worst commercials. Yeah, exactly. You don't remember it, Roberto? Yeah. Yep, exactly. It was that bad. She was on a couch talking oh, to him. Oh, sitting on the couch, yeah. yeah with, the, with the lady, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah, exactly. It was that bad. Uh, another one that was considered one of the worst was the starry love triangle with your favorite person, Rico, Ice Spice. Is that who that was? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Once again, I'm like, who is this? I feel old. It was a waste. It really was. It was not good. She'd seen her ex-boyfriend in the club or whatever. Well, I guess it was supposedly Sprite. And... Well, Starry is the... Sierra Mist, right? Yeah, Sierra Mist replacement com- competition with Sprite. So I yeah. was like, okay, this is weird. <laughs> yeah, that one missed the mark for me, too. Yeah, uh, another one, um, and this seems to be hated everywhere. I've looked on Twitter. I've looked everywhere. Is the DoorDash, all the ads. Yes, because you know what? At the end of the game, I'm like, screw it. Maybe I could try to win. So I go to the website, type in angrily, and it tells me you've got a, you've only uh, done 1% of the work. Did I type it wrong? I retype it again. I did it three times until I finally realized, wait, there was more to the code in the commercial that – they said simply put this up, and then they quickly flashed like 600 characters afterwards. I'm like, yeah, not going to happen. Yeah. Poor Rico. His team loses. He can't even get his DoorDash. <laughs> He's trying to win. I'm like, at least <laughs> Let I win at something. I, 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 you know what? Fine. I'll get cars and stuff like that. No. Rico no. gets a coin out heads or two. I got to win something. No, but then it tells you, like, you've only got 1% of it. Like, what do you mean 1%? Like, what? What? Yeah. Another one, before we get to some of the best, or what you thought were some of your best, uh, was the Mr. T Skechers commercial was considered one of the worst. Because there's no T. There's yeah. no T. And I, this one simply says, because Romo was in it, it was too much of Romo last night. <laughs> they didn't need more. And yeah, not his finest work. Him and Nance never seem to be like on the same page. They're having two different conversations. It's like a forced marriage. Yeah. What yep. else? So we'll get to, we'll get to some of the best in a second, but I want to ask you all: Did you have a favorite? I like the State Farm Arnold Schwarzenegger commercial. Really? Like a good neighbor. Uh, Backstabber. If it was witty. Were you able to even focus on the commercials, Rico? It was an important game for your team. No, no, I was okay. able to. They weren't that great. I thought the one that I thought was funny was um, I thought the Beyonce one was funny. Like, I'm going to break the internet. You're still not breaking. I'm going to go in space and do it. Still not doing it. Great show, though. So, yeah, that one. And I actually thought the uh, Ben Affleck showing up to J-Lo in the recording oh, studio. Oh, I hated that one. And she's just like, Ben, we we talked about this. We talked about. And then Damon is like, remember when I said I'd do anything for you? Consider this anything. Okay. It was a Dunkin' Donuts spot. Brady was in it, too. It, that one felt like they were trying too hard. I they, think they were, were, but that's what made that one funny I because guess. she had to look like, oh, dear God, he's, you know, he just showed up at my job thinking like, oh, yeah, I'm coming to save the day. Like, no, we talked about this. I liked, uh, was it Kawasaki? They had the mullet, Stone Cold Steve Austin. I thought that was a good one. I like the M&M one, not to rub it in, but they had the comfort ring. Yeah. Oh, with the, 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 the former, ju- yeah, T.O. Yeah, T.O., yeah. he's, he's signing so like that. Yeah. Bruce Smith. That yeah. ended up being 25th on this list. So I guess they didn't they didn't like it. They didn't hate it. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to think. Did did McDonald's have a commercial? No. 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 I don't think any, I don't think think any fast did. food did. Did any fast food company? I don't think so. I don't, not that I remember. No. Oh, yes, Popeye's. Oh, yeah, with, um. Yeah. what's that guy? Yeah, the guy from uh, Ken Jong, right? Yes, I, yeah. I did like the commercial. I thought it was cute. The commercial with the little boy and he was playing with everybody. And he was like Saquon. He handed the ball off to Saquon. Oh yeah, oh see him and yours at the end. And he was to like, yeah. yeah, son, that's on you because I'm not even here. That's on you. You better go get the ball. And then it was like, oh okay, it's one of those heartfelt commercials. I like that. Yeah, that was pretty good. So let's get to what they consider on this list of top ten: the Doritos commercial, the Dina and Mita. Yeah. It's fine. Uh, it's not bad. Grandmothers going after the yeah. chips. 
Um, of the Verizon one. That's the Beyonce one, right? No, yeah. that- can't be broken. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the Budweiser old school delivery was number eight on this list. They brought back the horses. That's they what, did. The horses People and the dog. Love those Clydesdales. Well, no, and the dog. It was a dumb commercial. Jesus, it really was. They David. tried too hard. They David, really did. Let I'm love sorry. in your heart, man. Um, the Jesus. walking, talking like walking. I thought commercial. that was trying too hard. Yeah, that was. The only thing that was good about that was at the end when it was Usher. He was like, "Don't you got some place to be?" That was the only funny part of it. Right. Um, the old commercial Rico, the Born to Play, was was top yeah. five here. Um, the Uber Eats. This was the uh, one with the Friends. Uh, Cast. Well, they forget. Oh, they forget. Yeah. yeah. And then Usher sitting there like, man, I wish I could do a halftime show. And the dude's like, are you serious? So Usher's in two commercials and the halftime show. Interesting. It's good. Good money when you can get it. Uh, the uh, Dung Kings one, you mentioned that one. That was number two on this list. See, it just shows I have class and you don't. Whatever. <laughs> they called worse. <laughs> What's number one? You know why? They were just too conservative. Oh, boy. Number one is... Your favorite, like a good neighbor. Yes, like a good neighbor. No, was number you know what? One. It just shows that any. Yo, know, I take that back. <laughs> neighbor, like, what are we? I'm saying it, neighbor. What are we doing here? Did they? Did they at all step into the controversial one? Which one is that? That was at the bottom. I, I didn't really want to get into <laughs> that. That was at the bottom. They didn't like the um, the feet washing one. They the did Jesus not like one. that oh. one. Yeah. Oh, they got people all riled up. That was at the bottom. They Because they ranked all of them. There were 59 commercials. Oh, that wow. one actually ended up being number 44 on their How dare list. you? Yeah. You, you know. You Conviction. Did. This is a football game. No Jesus. Yeah, it. There was one that was 59. I'm thinking you could probably guess what 59 was. It was political. Oh, oh yeah. We don't need Hmm. They say on here, waste of money. They really do. <laughs> the one. Wait, was it the Kennedy one? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I was waiting for the parody. Like, okay, I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> you thought there was going to be like a like a, right, I like was a like, joke at the end So I'm of trying it. to figure out, like, what actor is this? Like, Because <laughs> it was like the old school song and the old school, you know, effects. And it was like, okay, it was in, you know, four by, it was shot in four by three. He's so, like, guys, I don't get it. What's the, right. what's the punchline? So by the end, I was like, wait, that was a real campaign commercial. Yeah, he used the old school JFK. He's going to lose because yeah. he blew his whole election campaign money on this commercial thinking this was going to work. And in the end, I'm like, huh? There was a moment as we were going to the fourth quarter. You might as well have got what, Jason Momoa in there to do it. I would have at least said okay. Well, Momo was in a commercial, wasn't he? It was uh, was it T-Mobile? Yeah, yeah. With yeah, uh, that was the, outside the, the top ten. Yes. yes. Okay. One other one that you didn't mention. I know we're we're up. The Sarah V one with Michael Sarah. Yes. That ended up being in the top twenty on this. Okay. List. Really? You didn't yeah. like that one? Number no, fifteen. I don't like him. What's well, like awkward humor? That's his thing. Still doesn't mean I like him. Okay. I don't. He's never been funny to me. All righty then, and that is your <laughs> Super Bowl commercial, which 97 won.